<clears throat> hello, 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 Aquarius. This is Mystic Virgo 4444. Thank you all so very much for joining me for another reading. Thank you all for uh, liking and subscribing. For my new subscribers, I really appreciate you for joining me here. I'm going to do a reading for you all. It's going to be a timeless reading for you. So whenever you uh, catch this reading, Aquarius, it's, it's for you when you see it. It doesn't have to necessarily be for today. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and shuffle. Did some pre shuffling before. I started rolling, so I'm just going to get started. Hope you all are having a good day. Good evening, good morning. Take care of residence, okay? What is going on for the Aquarius? What messages do you have for me to pass along to the Aquarius? What messages do you have for me to pass on? Some love. Ooh. You have a great love that you manifested. A love that you worked very, 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 very hard at keeping, okay, Aquarius? But something's going on. You're hurting about something. Um, something is going, ooh, it's a burden. Something is going on in your love relationship. Um, you're heading, heading away from it. Wow, okay. So, Aquarius, let's see what's going on here. You have a relationship that you've been been in for a while with someone who it has been a what you thought was a destined relationship, but something is going on. A lot of of deception, lies, um, things that weren't going right, and you're hurt about the situation. Okay, probably somebody cheated in the relationship, Aquarius, and it's a heavy, heavy burden. It's hurting you. It really, really hurts you. Um, but you need to cut it out. You need to let this relationship go. It's no longer for your good. It's no longer for the good of you to be in this relationship. So you're going to move out of the household, leave the situation alone, break up with the person that you've been with for a long, long time because you thought that this person was your soulmate. But this person cheated. Ended the re well, he cheated or she ended the relationship by cheating. And that's why the relationship ended because somebody was not faithful in the relationship and you had to cut this person out. You're leaving the situation behind. But once you leave this relationship behind, you're going to run smack dab into your true destiny, a true lover, a, a true, uh, I almost want to say a true homie, a true homie lover friend kind of relationship. You're going to feel at home with this new person who's coming into your life, Aquarius. Um, so it's, it's a blessing for you to leave this situation because once you leave this this uh, narcissistic situation behind, God is going to bless you with someone new. The Empress or the Emperor, take it how it resonates with you. It's going to change your world. Your overall energy is a change is coming for you. A change is going to come for you, Aquarius. Okay. I'm getting here not to shuffle anymore, so I'm going to stop shuffling. Yeah, you have some good stuff coming your way. Uh, your, your world is changed. You're going to get offers. Um, you're going to enjoy your life better. You may have to work on money, save me some money, though, because you're going to be by yourself. So I have the emperor, but I also have the empress. So this emperor, emperor, this new person who's going to come into your life after you drop this dead weight, Aquarius, <clears throat> is going to be a blessing to you. They're going to help you out in this new world of yours. You're probably going to move to a different location, a different city, different state, mm, maybe a different address. You know, because you're leaving a situation behind. Um, but you're going to head towards something more beautiful, more meaningful. Somebody who's going to take care of you. Okay? You're going to be focused on your income because you're going to be a single parent. But that's okay. Even if you don't leave the situation and um, you don't walk away from this relationship, the person who cheated is going to walk away because you're going to put them out of your life. You're going to put them out of your um, home. Somebody's going to leave the home. And once that happens, Aquarius, you're going to, to move on with your life to someone new. It's going to be hard at first because you have to focus on a single income. But that's going to change because God is going to bless you with your emperor. You all are going to meet each other at your worst. You all are going to meet each other at your worst. And he's going to love you or she's going to love you. Take it how it resonates, okay? Very happy. They're your wish, for, they're your wish fulfillment. And they're going to bring you out of the pain and heartache that you're in because of because of your now ex who cheated on you, who lied to you, who cheated, who, who turned all of these different tricks 
and mess with your emotions that put you in a heavy heartbroken burden okay a burden that you really that didn't think that you could bear but you can get you can get past this okay Aquarius he hurt you she hurt you take it how it resonates and and they messed up the situation because they thought that they could hide everything they thought that they were strong they thought that they were legit but they weren't um, stone faced, act like they didn't give a care about your feelings. And they probably did because they're a narcissist, okay? But this heavy burden for you is like a blessing in disguise because you're going to run into somebody who's going to care about you. Like I said, they're going to care about you at your worst. And you're headed toward a beautiful new lifestyle, a beautiful new beginning for you and your child, okay? But you, you, it's like it's going to be a situation with this emperor who's coming into your life, or empress, because you, you're both here. Um, almost as if it's too good to believe. It's, um, is this really happening to me? Yes, it is. Give this person a chance to love you the right way. You've never been loved like this before. You've never known love like this before. But it's coming. It's going to be a wish fulfillment. Everything you've ever wanted from a lover is going to be with this with this person. Okay. You all are going to, to make a good life together. You're focused on looking back at what you've been through. Yeah. You're definitely focusing on what you've been through before. You're still caught up in your feelings here, Aquarius, for what you've been through before. Um, thinking about what you've been through, looking back at your past. But know that it's just that, the past. You have to have justice. You're getting... Um, your past is going to be um, buried, dead and buried, because you're, you're going to finally realize that I can do better. I deserve better, so I'm going to walk away from the negativity that was in my past, because you don't need it anymore. It's time for you to let that past go. Know that you have something better coming for you, okay, Aquarius? Um, an offer. This person may want to try to come back and offer you something, but it's not really a... a, a, a a healthy offer because they're a narcissist. They just don't want anyone else to have your goodness. They don't want anybody else to have you. This is why they want to come back. They want to give you very little to try to keep you holding on. Okay, but you're coming out of it. You say, I don't need you. I don't need you or require you in my life because you're full of it. They're the magician. Okay, they want to turn all of these tricks. They want to make you believe stuff that's not true. Um, they think they can constantly turn, put the wool over on your eyes. Okay. To make you believe because they, they've hurt you before, okay? They've left you hurt, downtrodden, and in pain. And you, now you're crying, thinking about what I should have did this, I should have, I should have, could have, would have, and all of that stuff. They see that, they, they think that they still got you in the mind, and they think they still got your mind, and they still think that they got your heart, but they're still with someone else, okay? And they feel stuck. I'm with this person, I made this decision, but they know that you cut them out. I have a queen of swords and a king of swords. King of swords. You're doing what you're doing. You lied to me. You cheated on me. You played games with me and my heart. You threatened me. So it's time for me to step. So you've stepped. You've moved on. And you're not going to go back. Not going to go back. You judged the situation accordingly. You paid attention. You paid attention to the red flash. You're going to let this person go and move on to your hero. Okay? You're going to let this person go, of course, and move on to your hero. You're not going to accept their uh their cup of love that they want to give you there because they want to come back at some point but you're not going to accept this you don't need this you have other things that you have to worry about better things that you have to worry about okay because your world is changing you definitely have some changes coming for you in your world in your love in your life okay um dealing with this person was a negative thing but they changed you they're making you a better person because of who you are and because of why you're headed. They've changed the course of your life. They, actually, they've changed the course of your very existence. Okay? Their um, free will choices has changed the course of your life. Their, their free will choices have pushed you into a new era of happiness. They're pushing you to meet your match. The ex, the person you cheated with, the person who you loved and cared about, who you who you were very, very fond of, they cheated. But they're pushing you to your new destiny. Hmm. 
They're pushing you to your new destiny. Okay, you all are going to be a power keg of excitement together. A wish fulfillment for both of you all. Both of you all. For you and the person you're going to meet. Okay. Uh, no more third party situation. You don't have to be dealing with that that issue because you you. So the person who cheated, who you're breaking up with, who you left, or who left you. It's a third party situation. This is some shit that you don't have to worry about. Okay, let let him have who he wants because you have you're going to be blessed with this new person that's coming into your life. Okay, all because of the third party situation. All because of the three of cups that they still have, but they are they still want to offer you just that one cup. But they want to offer you this one cup, Aquarius, because they want to keep you in their sights. They don't want anybody else to have you. They don't want you. But they don't want anybody else to have you. They don't want you. But they don't want anybody else to have you. But you have an emperor or an empress that's coming your way. Okay? Take it how it resonates. And it is it's, this is this is who you are. This is what you are here for to be happy, to be loved, to be respected. And this person who's coming into your life is going to respect you. Okay, you have a tower moment. You're going through some stuff. You're hurt. You're downtrodden. You're in a lot of pain from the sneakiness that this person has done, the lies and the deception that this person has has brought to you and into your life, okay? Just know that you may feel like you're in a tower moment right now. You may feel like you are at rock bottom, but that's going to change for you, okay? He's going to be texting you. Your ex is going to be texting you, uh, probably watching, your, watching you, probably following you around, probably stalking you a little bit, and you don't even realize it. Because they're trying to keep tabs on you. They know they hurt you. But they're trying to see what the next steps are for you. What are you going to do? Are you going to let this person keep you down? Are you going to move on with your life and be happy with someone else? Okay? Because you're, you're the uh, the high priestess. If you're standing in your own power, you know exactly who you are. You know what you want in your life. You know what you don't want. You know that it's time for you to let this go. Uh, you should have let it go a long time ago. So Because your world is changing. You want something different for your life. You want to be happy in your life, okay? And this is why you know that it's time for you to let this situation go. Because sneaky is out and love is in. Let this person do what he wants to do or she wants to do with their life. Let them play games with someone else because they're good at manipulation. They're the king or and queen of manipulation. Let them manipulate someone else. Let them uh, hurt and, and berate someone else. You know, heaven forbid they do that, but hell, they're, they're a narcissistic individual. So they're going to do that because that's who they are. Aquarius, that's that's what they know. That's how they operate. They don't know how to be anything else than what they are. Just a, a nasty, toxic, hateful individual. Um, and they just don't know any better, okay? That's just who they are. They're never going to change. And you're at a point in your life to where you know it's time for you to step into your own power and let the negativity go so you won't have to be hurt forever with this person okay this person is toxic and this person is not for you it's time for you to find better okay i'm going to do an animal spirit card reading for you and then i'm going to end the reading aquarius i'm going to get one card for you aquarius for your animal spirit guides and see what i have for you okay give me one card for the aquarius what do i need to let the aquarius know? one spirit animal card for the Aquarius. Yeah, these are some thick cards, you all. So it's hard for me to uh, shuffle. Uh, let's see. One card for the Aquarius. So it looks like I have, uh, it looks like I have two cards. Some no three. So y'all don't want y'all three cards for the Aquarius. So let's see what I have here. I have the Loon, which is intuitive. The horse, which which means freedom for you, Aquarius. And they have the giraffe, which is a visionary. So here's the loon for you, Aquarius, the loon. And it says, listen to the song in your soul. Trust your intuition as you have a way of knowing. Emerge from the busy life and seek more solitude. Recognize that you are unique and that you are loved. Recognize that you are unique and you are loved. You may be leaving a toxic situation, but you're headed to something so much more meaningful and beautiful. And I have here the horse, which means freedom for you. Aquarius, the horse, which is freedom. Your heart is pure and free. 
a greater purpose calls you. You have unlimited reserves of stamina and strength. You follow the winds of change and accomplish your dreams. You follow the winds of change and accomplish your dreams. Okay. So I'm going to read your last spirit animal card here, which is the giraffe. It uh, bring, It's a visionary. Rise above earthly matters. Glide through life with grace. You are able to see the right path. Stand tall in your self-worth and love with a big heart. Love with a big heart. Keep on doing what you are doing because it's whatever you're doing, it's working for you, Aquarius, okay? Love who you are. Get past this relationship, this narcissistic, negative person, this relationship. Let that go and move on to a beautiful future with your emperor or your empress. Take it how it resonates with you for this reading, okay? I hope it resonates with you all, and I will talk to you all again soon.